Hi, my name is Sam Dhanishekaran and welcome to this Database Lessons video series. In this video, we will go over some of the basics of a SELECT statement. Okay, so before even proceeding that, proceeding with that, I wanted to show you one more thing. Uh, those who watched uh, the video 62, which is about creating table using a SELECT method, you may notice that I stumbled on something. I was actually looking for a refresh button here and my mistake was I was looking for a refresh button at the database level. But you go to the tables and then you do a refresh. So then it will show the the table that we just created, that I just created like a few minutes ago. Okay. So now back to select. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a simple select. Select star from test 1. Okay. If you see it has the results. Basically what it does is it brings the result from all the columns. Employee ID, first name, last name, email, phone number and everything. Okay. How do I know what are the columns that are there in this table? What I should do is describe the table, right? Select the command and click run. So when I do describe the table name, it shows me what are the columns that are there and whether they are null columns or not null columns and the attributes or the type of the columns. For example, employee ID can have only numerical values because it says number and it's six bytes long. And the first name, uh, it's varchar2. It can um, have numbers as well as text. Okay, so like that. Now, select. I did a select star from test and then it gave me these results. I can, if I want to see the total number of rows in a table, what I can do is I can do select count star from the table. So then it will give me the number of rows, count star, 107 rows are there in this table. Okay. I can also use some where class to restrict the data that I'm going to see. For example, I want to see uh, uh, the, the rows where the last name is king. Okay, so what I can do is select star from test one where last name equals to open quote single quote k a n g sorry k a n g in upper case okay okay so it's case sensitive here and it did not bring any result now if i do King. Okay, so it brought me the rows where the last name is King. Okay, and uh, I can also restrict this by the columns that I want to see. Instead of doing star if I just want to see employee ID comma first name comma last name then I can do that also it just brings me employee first name last name okay so the the format is you do a select and then you specify what you want to select. 
if it is star then it's everything I mean every columns from the table and then you pass a where class where you specify the filter that's the format okay and this is just a basic there are a lot of uh, things that can be done using a select statement I just wanted to give you a, a basic okay you can also for example like now I can do select start from test one where I'm sorry where row num is less than 50 what this will do is it will just bring the first 49 rows because where I say the row num there is no column called row num but this is an oracle inbuilt identifier uh, where uh, the row number is less than 50 okay so then it would bring the first 49 rows so there are lots of functions and uh, uh, you know exploring the select statement would be a good idea uh, for anyone who wants to learn SQL thank you